Hello guys, how are you? Or kamusta mga boss idol? Welcome back to our channel, Chantry Wonders, and it's me again, Christian. Well, last year, me and my wife went to Banff National Park, Canada for our summer getaway. It was almost September, and I will tell you right now, that was an amazing trip. And due to pandemic, borders were closed, only Canadians and permanent residents are the people who can travel to Alberta. So there's only small traffic walking around the main street and exploring Banff. Banff is a little town set in the heart of the Rockies, bursting with a sense of adventure, excitement, and Canadian spirit. The vibrant downtown streets are filled with unique restaurants, cafes, bars, and stores that encapsulate the friendly local vibe that make it so hard to leave. Banff is one of the most beautiful national parks in Canada. Breathtaking mountain scenery, epic hiking trails, and picturesque camping grounds and lodges, whether you're looking to reconnect with nature, up to your photography game, or canoe down the pristine Lake Louise, Banff is an absolute dream. Banff might just be one of the prettiest places we've ever been. It offers something new and different. This is actually our second trip to Banff National Park, Canada. And on this video, we will going to give a travel tips about Banff National Park that you should know before you go. Visitors in Banff National Park, Canada require a park pass for entry. For adults, it will be $10, youth is free, and for a senior, it will be $8.40. Park passes can be purchased online at the park gates if driving to the park or in person at the visitor center inside Banff. Banff National Park entry fees help support visitor, service, and facilities. This means that every time you visit, you are investing in the park and in a legacy for future generations. Second on our list, how much money will you need for your trip to Banff? If you're planning to stay in town of Banff, you should plan to spend around $93 per day. This is the average daily price based on the expenses on our trip. Oh. So, so, maganda pala dito. So, this, ito yung labas ng ano namin. So, there's a fireplace. This then, that's a TV. Oh, we have a second floor. Look. So, there's a couch here. So, if you want to refresh. So, there's a stair going upstairs. There. Wow. Oh, sorry. So, that's our bed for five days oh there's two tv eh? two tv huh? the view outside it's nice there's aircon up there we picked the hotel with breakfast already so that there will be no more hassle to cook or to decide which restaurant are we going to eat for breakfast. The city of Banff is located inside the national park. Look at our background view. The town is definitely a place to stop. It has so many restaurants, a river walk, and shopping stores within the town proper. Mountain getaway place and it's surrounded by amazing peaks and scenery. Mm -hmm. 
Banff is a busy place and crowded during summer. When we visited Banff last September 2018, it was very crowded at most of the main sites. It's so hard to avoid the crowds around Banff in the summertime. In Banff Town, Sulpur Mountain and Lake Midewanka, it's almost impossible. Our best Banff travel tip for avoiding the crowds is to get up as early as possible and stay out later. Around Moraine Lake and Lake Louise, it will be crowded around 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. So set up your alarm early. However, if you hang out around till 9 p.m., you can generally score some good space. The lakes in Banff are really turquoise blue. The color of the lake is due to glacial wash. In reality, the color is due to rock floor carried in the glacial melt that trickles down to the lake. The sun reflects off these particles, refracting blue and green wavelengths of light. You can take a canoe ride on those turquoise blue lakes. Some of the lakes in Banff National Park have a canoe rentals, but it will cost you a pretty penny. This will be a gorgeous way to enjoy the lakes and scenery of the mountains around you. Just be prepared to pay around $100 to $125 per hour to rent a canoe. Just a little tip to save your money, you can bring your own paddle and canoe. If you have some, uh, just don't forget your safety life jackets. That's it for this video, mga boss idol. My name is Christian. And I'm Trini. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more videos. Bye bye. Paala! <laughs>